Hello everyone, and welcome to my Days of Our Lives official. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. According to previews for Days of Our Lives, Thanksgiving will bring some beautiful festivities from November 25th to 29th, but the tone will quickly shift to one of melancholy. Let's discuss how it will all work out because Doug Williams' unfortunate fate will dampen the celebrations. First up, Jennifer Horton Devereaux and Jack Devereaux will be back to assist in the celebration. Eli Grant and Lonnie Grant will also return in time for Turkey and all the trimmings, so this is also true. While Doug will continue to struggle with his health and remain hidden away in his bedroom, Julie Williams will be overjoyed to see everyone again. As a result, Jack will have to make a challenging discovery and eventually admit that Doug passed away while he was sleeping. According to teasers for days, Julie will grieve the loss and look for a way to bid her love farewell. The fact that Susan Seaforth Hayes actually went through Julie's pain will make it even more difficult to see, especially since Bill Hayes died away back in January. In DOL's November 28th episode, Julie experiences her first heartbreak. The next day, word of Doug's death will spread. According to Day's spoilers for November 29th, Sean Brady, Brandon Beamer, and Hope Brady, Christian Alfonso, will also be taking some time to grieve. Given that Sean's grandfather was Doug and Hope's father was Doug, it is understandable that they will require some consolation from one another. Both of them will find it difficult to accept the concept of living without Doug. Naturally, Julie will receive a lot of support as well, so expect a large number of salemites to support her. Funeral arrangements will soon begin, so we'll make sure to provide you with more story forecasts and updates on Doug's ceremony as the time draws near. The story will center on Thanksgiving becoming tragic for the time being. Unfortunately, Days will utilize the holiday to set the stage for Doug's tragic parting, so it won't end happily. According to spoilers for Days of Our Lives, Doug's passing will result in some heartbreaking scenes and pave the way for further appearances, so tune in. According to spoilers for Days of Our Lives, Ava Vitali appeared to be in a difficult predicament in the Days of Days 2024 promo film. When Ava murmured that someone else was here, Kristen DiMera, Stacey Hayduke, who was present, appeared perplexed. It was probably a trap because it appears like Kristen walked straight into the kidnapping of Ava. Why would they abduct both Kristen and Ava, and who might the villain be? Let's discuss the options after you finish reading. According to teasers, Ava and Kristen appeared in the 2024 promotional clip Four Days of Days. It appeared as though Ava might have been bound, but the scenes went by really quickly, and my pause button wasn't working well. Ava looked as though she had been abducted or held as a hostage. Kristen was then spotted crouched close to Ava. Kristen DiMera is trapped in DOL spoilers. There is another person here. Ava said as Kristen knelt down. The warning sounded urgent. The commercial cut to another shot as Kristen appeared perplexed and began to turn her head. It appears that a hostage situation could involve both Kristen and Ava. But who would abduct both Kristen and Ava? Will Connie Vinisky make a devilish comeback? According to spoilers on Days of Our Lives, it could be Connie Vinisky. Connie did not commit murder when she was last seen. Gabby Hernandez and Melinda Trask. Then Connie was cornered by Jada Hunter. After her misdeeds were eventually discovered, Connie was transferred to Bayview. But in the last few weeks, Connie has been brought up a few times. Javi Hernandez was given the story's cliff notes by Gabby. Additionally, Gabby wants the workplace to be cleared of anything associated with Connie. Could the criminal come back for retribution since both Ava and Kristen contributed to Connie's demise? Connie does have a tendency to hold other people accountable for her own behavior. Despite killing Lee Shin, Connie blamed Gabby directly. DOL spoilers, how heroic is Brady Black? Connie might seek retribution if she manages to get out of Bayview. Connie may not have a good chance to go after Gabby directly once more. Connie might, however, accuse Kristen and Ava. Will Brady Black, Eric Martzolf, emerge as the unexpected hero if Connie ends up snatching Ava and Kristen? There is a chance that Brady and Kristen may reunite, but a teaser also shows him kissing Ava. Therefore, it would be intriguing if Brady were to prove himself to both of his romantic interests. 
Spoilers for Tuesday, November 19th episode of Days of Our Lives, DOL, indicate that Salem will see some intriguing events. Will two co-workers breach a line as a strange illness develops at one company and a whistleblower returns? It's time to see what type of drama Tuesday will bring. Body and soul falls, I'm sick. According to Tuesday, November 19 spoilers, every member of Body and Soul's cast and crew will become ill. Is this a severe case of the flu or food poisoning? In any case, it appears that Hattie Adams' curse will persist in the series, therefore, is it time to terminate the entire soap opera? Many DOL fans are hoping that the response is yes. Spoilers for days, the return of Lady Whistleblower. Having said that, DOL teasers for Tuesday, November 19th suggest that the soap opera's lead writer may take on a new role this week. Although it has been a while since Lady Whistleblower was spotted in Salem, it appears like Leo Stark may return to the role in the coming days. Gabby Hernandez, meantime, is not pleased with Leo's developing relationship with her cousin Javi Hernandez. Nevertheless, it appears that Rafe Hernandez will defend their partnership. Spoilers for Days of Our Lives, do Joy Wesley and Alex Kiriakis get together? In other developments, according to teasers for Tuesday's episode, Alexis Kiriakis and Joy Wesley will meet up and appear to be practicing lines for upcoming sequences. Will they hook up, though, given the additional teases that appear to suggest they might be going too far? John DiMera will always feel bad about cheating on Chanel DiMera, speaking of crossing lines. Is he going to come forward? Joy has a lot to say about it, so no. Are you looking forward to the show on Tuesday? Participate in the discussion in the comment box. Visit SOS for the finest days of our lives spoilers, news, and updates, and watch the Peacock Soap Opera every day to find out what happens next. According to previews on Days of Our Lives, DOL, Connie Vinisky was transferred to Bayview for failing to murder Gabby Hernandez. Gabby's new assistant, Javi Hernandez, seems like a poor fit right away. Could Connie come back, as she's been referenced a couple times lately? By locating Stefan DiMera and bringing Gabby back to her true love, may Connie gain atonement? Let's talk about the possibilities once you finish reading. The Introduction of Javi Hernandez According to DOL spoilers, Connie attempted to murder several individuals. This comprises Rafe Hernandez, Galen Gehring, Melinda Trask, Ava Vitali, Stefan, and Gabby. Additionally, Connie was successful in killing Everett Lynch, also known as Robert Bobby Stein, Blake Barris, and Lee Shin. Connie was taken to Bayview after she was eventually busted. Gabby was thus left without the ideal helper. Rafe and Gabby recently got back together with their cousin Javi. Shortly after arriving in Salem, Gabby asked Javi to work as her assistant. Javi initially appeared unsure before becoming enthusiastic. Javi began to change his mind after discovering that he was just running errands. Naturally, Javi is also constantly sidetracked by Greg Rickard's character, Leo Stark. Javi recently told Leo that Gabby is totally damaged by the divorce. Gabby now attempted to inform Stefan that she had reconsidered. Stefan was gone by the time Gabby arrived at the DiMera estate. Gabby believes Stefan signed the divorce papers and then departed. Fans are aware that Stefan was prevented from reuniting with Gabby by Vivian Alamein. According to spoilers for Days of Our Lives, Connie has been brought up a number of times recently. That may occasionally signal a character's impending return. Typically, villains seek atonement when they return. It was obvious that Connie was unstable and disturbed. Connie could return to Salem in good mental health but seeking atonement. Gabby would never be able to trust or forgive Connie again unless it was related to Stefan. Would locating Stefan and returning him to Gabby be Connie's way of atonement? Gabby has always bragged about how Connie was the ideal assistant, regardless of the killer's behavior. Even though I already love Javi, I don't think he's cut out for the business world. Thus, Gabby still requires a helper at Gabby Chic. Is it possible that Connie will return to Salem? Will Connie be seeking atonement but in good mental health? Could Connie locate Stefan and bring Stabby back together as a result?